what's up guys Sindos here so without any hesitation I'm going to show you how to install them you already have pre-installed something called boxes basically boxes is like a virtual machine on your Fedora machine yeah you just put in how much memory you want so basically you can install any ISO file this is mostly handy for if you want to try out another um, Linux system, but it works just fine on if you want to try out the uh, Windows software or such. So for me, I personally, Windows XP brings back lots of memories because I remember back in the days, uh, 10 years ago or a really long time ago, we used to play games on the Windows XP with my cousin. He was the type of guy that would play games such as Dota, Yuri's Revenge, strategy games. He was the, the guy that would play those types of games. But this just brings back good memories and yeah, basically it's, it's a good system. And actually my laptop was a really bad laptop, this one, this is a school laptop and it came with 4 gigabytes of RAM. So, it also had Windows 10 on it, so as you can imagine, it was really slow and everybody was complaining in the class about it. So basically, I just uh, I just replaced the 4 gigabytes of RAM to 16 gigabytes of RAM. So yeah, now it's a lot faster, especially that I put uh, Linux on it. Linux runs really smoothly on it, because Windows 10 would run kind of slow, I guess. And there you go, it's loading Windows XP on your Linux Fedora machine. So basically I tried out um, uh, Linux, um, I also tried out um, Ubuntu based system called um, Pop OS, yes Pop OS. So that's one of my liked systems I guess. It's pretty nice and it has really similar design to this a GNU, GNU based system just like um, this one it's really simple and open source of course so if I, I, I would be also trying it out on on this computer and then later on I'm, I'm gonna show you how to adjust the screen resolution to fit to yeah basically so it's gonna show on your computer and such so yeah you don't really have to do anything with the internet it's gonna do it later automatically uh, okay so control and alt deselects your uh, main mouse from your windows xp to your normal mouse and if you click it again it's gonna go back so now normally all right but <laughs> let's just be happy that it worked out until now Actually, I've done this already one time, so I'm just gonna wanna do it again. Oh, this is so iconic! This this animation. Oh my god, I remember this. So, welcome, welcome, welcome. This is the very iconic Windows XP background that any everybody knows about. It's you, s you look at this background, you already know that this is Windows XP. Let me. You see, as you can see, it's working. You can download. You can just download Opera. 
or you can download Firefox or Windows, uh, I mean um, Google Chrome. So you see, you don't really have to adjust anything. You just download Opera. I don't know about you guys, but this makes me so happy. This is like, this is like my childhood, you know? Like I am a millennial, <laughs> I know. And I'm not from the 90s or anything. I'm from the, I'm from 2000. But it, this makes me so happy. This is so, nostalgic like I, I I remember everything exactly how it was and it's so crazy so that's it for the video guys thanks for watching hopefully I'll be making other videos too and peace and have a great day